trial of Nas Calpurnius Pisa and his wife Plancina is now resumed. We understand that the principal witness in the charge of poisoning has not been found. In her absence, the prosecution have no case, and we request that the charge be withdrawn. Request denied. If it please the Emperor, the wife of Nias Calpurnius Piso has asked that from now on her defense be conducted separately from her husband's and that she be tried independently from him. Why? Why did you do this to me? Don't you see what they'll think? Do you want me to die? They've made up their minds. There's nothing you nor I can say will change them. The Emperor has abandoned you. He's given you up to the mob. There's nothing on earth can save you now. What about you? I'll go to Livia. She at least stands by her friends. Oh, Piso, listen to me. There's the honor and wealth of our family to be saved. Our sons, our daughters, our grandchildren. What of them? If you, if you take your life now, if you take your life, there's a chance and a good one that an honorable death will preserve the family wealth. Well, execution means only one thing. Destruction for all we've built. Fall on a sword. Is that what you want for me, your husband? Is that to be the end of Nias Copernicus Piso? Hmm? No. There is another way. You go to Olivia, yes. Tell her I have a letter, another letter. She'll remember the one she wrote. It's in her name and his. But it bears no seal. Tell her no power on earth will prevent me reading it in the Senate aloud tomorrow unless I have assurances of acquittal. You're bluffing. No. Tell her. She'll remember. Tell her I intend to read it aloud in the Senate tomorrow. Well, don't look at me as if I just told you I was pregnant. He's got a letter, and it's very incriminating. And he'll read it unless we do something about it. You wrote a letter? In my name and yours? Without even using the seal? You were away. And anyway, you don't let me use the seal. Who's emperor here? Your eye. I used Augustus's seal. I had the free use of that. I am not Augustus. No, you're not. Otherwise, this situation would never have arisen. I think I shall go mad. You will drive me insane. Will you stay out of my affairs? Your affairs? You wouldn't be emperor if it weren't for me. Well, what's done can be undone. Plancina isn't the only one with letters. I've got plenty from Augustus saying exactly what he thought about you, and don't think I won't have them circulated if I have to. What do you want? I don't want that letter read in the Senate. You'd be a fool if you allowed it. You want my assurances that they'll be acquitted? Of course I do. They should be acquitted. 
And if you had any backbone, you'd get them acquitted. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. It's your letter. You stick to it. And if it's read in the house, I'll deny all knowledge of it and excuse you on the grounds of mental incompetence brought on by extreme old age. And you can tell your friend, Francina, that there will be no deal. What a spineless, miserable, mean-spirited creature you are. He won't have it. He won't acquit your husband. There is too much feeling against him. And what about me? Well, uh, I was a little more successful there. In exchange for the letter, he will allow your husband to take his own life rather than face execution then he will see to it that you are spared and that your family and your estates do not suffer. And uh, if my husband refuses? Well, I would see to it that he doesn't refuse, if I were you. It shouldn't be hard. Appeal to his sense of honor. Men find that irresistible. And what guarantee do I have that your son will get me acquitted? Well, you see, I have Martina. But he doesn't know that. Now, his chances of convicting you without her are remote. On the other hand, if that letter is read, I shall be compelled, very reluctantly, to produce her. He won't help us. He has abandoned us. Oh, that, that miserable cur. I shall read this letter. The Senate will see what sort of emperor they have and what sort of bitch gave him birth and calls herself mother of the nation. No, 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 wait, wait, please listen to me. We can't fight them. They're too powerful. And anyway, there's the children and, and the estates. Is the whole family to be destroyed because of us? Oh, I can't believe it. It's not right. I won't allow it. We've lived together. We'll die together, too. Oh, there's comfort in that, isn't there? You would die with me? Oh, I couldn't live without you. We leave the letter for Livia. She'll help the family when we've gone. I know that. Yes, you're right. I'm tired of it all. To have everybody against you. All you've done is your duty. There's no gratitude anymore. No. No honor. The hell with Rome. I'm done with it. Hmm. How shall we do it? Open a vein. Let them find us lying together. Shall we let them find us lying together?
Oh, they're bluffing. They wouldn't dare have that letter read. Would you rather have an executioner's sword on your neck like a common criminal? It would never come to that. Oh, you coward. Well, I'm made of sterner stuff. Francina. I'll show you how a Roman should die. Francina, they're bluffing. They've never had that letter in Francina. They've never read... <laughs> 